All right, guys. This is not necessarily a cloudy day. This probably is like a sunny day. Let you see that little ball over through the hazy sky is the sun beginning to set through the wildfire smoke from 3,000 miles away here in the end times and what's left of paradise in upstate New York the uh, porta potties are overflowing and the sun's going down through the smoggy skies of western New York here on this uh, cool Sunday afternoon, now Sunday evening, August 19th, 2018. So, an old depressed collapsitarian is winding up the packed up camp. We are so fucked. Heading home, well, not heading home, heading back to the Doomsday Trailer after three days of partying like it's 1799 in uh, Sandy's kiss your ass goodbye party. So I'm um, sitting here letting this last three days of my life soak in and I'm just gonna figure out, let's see, let's do a, I don't know if this is a depressed collapsitarian whine or I call it more of a cautionary tale. What did I learn and what did I learn or what should I, what did I confirm? in three days of hanging out with my doomers my from Humpty Dumpty tribe my real life doomers that I'm getting to meet here from Humpty Dumpty tribe eight and a half years to it how many of my tribes members did I meet this week seven seven or eight seven or eight tribes members showed up look at that that's the sun setting through the wildfire smoke from the fires 3,000 miles away. Anyway, seven of my tribe's members got to meet and hang out with and party for three days, having a grand time. And uh, so these are a couple of things that I've learned this weekend. And uh, as I said, so guys, this is you know it, it's all we've got all we have is each other from uh, from here on out from this point forward all we have all us doomers and eco Nazis have in the end times is to is each other you know this mysterious myth of finding a small group of like-minded friends and hanging out and uh, just hanging out with my fellow doomers just you know just where you can have this conversation without being uh, relegated to the scrap heap of uh, you know just just being able to sit here and have this conversation about what's going on on this planet uh, and, and, and not being alienated, vilified, excommunicated, and all the rest. It's just such an absolute breath of fresh air uh, just for a few precious hours being able to have intelligent conversation and uh, You know, and just going through, then working through this together. It's just like a big, a big group therapy for us doomers. And it has been a fine weekend. And and uh, you know, as I say, it's we are who we have to depend on. Uh, you know, we need to have each other's backs because nobody else is gonna is gonna have each other's backs. You know. When uh, you lose another friend in the Doomosphere, uh, they're too damn hard to find. And so anyway, I was spent three days hanging out with my fellow Doomers, making some new friends here in real life in the Doomosphere. And then uh, 
And then this morning comes along and I open up my email box from a former Humpty Dumpty Tribes member now and everything, every single thing that uh, I just said, just in a matter of 30 seconds, this was flushed down the toilet. Where the second thing that was confirmed, you know, when you hold this little fantasy about all we have is each other to keep, you know, to watch each other's backs, and then you, you, you know, you open up your fucking email or whatever, and you and you pull the knife out of your back, uh, you know. And, and so this is the second thing, and, and I can say these things and hold both of these these contradictory thoughts in in, in my uh, in, in my brain. This is the flip side of everything I just said. Do not fucking trust anybody from this point forward. Uh, on one hand, all we have is each other uh, to get us through the shit storm that's coming down the pike. But then, uh, one, then I got reminded real quick that uh, do not trust anybody. Uh, down here in the Doomosphere. Well, it might not just be down here in the Doomosphere. It, it's, uh, you know, I, I've just had this rant a couple of weeks ago, and apparently the universe uh, wanted me not to forget it. You know, it's, it, it's don't trust anybody down here in the Doomosphere. Don't trust anybody uh, that's sure as hell that you meet on social media. And uh, just don't trust anybody. From this point forward, there is nobody you can depend on except yourself. Uh, as I say, I just had this rant a few days ago, and, and, I, and I hate to be repeating it. Uh, you know, after spending three days in, in the company of, uh, of new friends that I had made here, uh, you know, after eight and a half years of doing what I've done with my life, uh, and, and seeing uh, the fruits of my labor, which is uh, the, these new friendships and whatnot, and and just uh, enjoying the breath of fresh air, and then opening up my fucking email to some toxic goddamn backstabbing fucking bullshit, uh, you know, from from one of my main lieutenants. Uh, you know, one, one of the one of the major people, uh, I, you know, having to kick this dude out of the tribe. I mean, it hurt me, but uh, it taught me a valuable lesson. For the second time now, in what four months, uh, I've uh, eradicated two of the, you know, two of my closest. Uh, confidants here, uh, and, 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 you know, and it fucking sucks, but uh, it, it, it's a lesson that I need to learn, that uh, while, we, while we're looking for our few like-minded friends to uh, survive the end times with, you need, to, you need to fucking watch out for those knives. Uh, between the, the ribs in your back, uh, you know, it just really, it really fucking depresses me. Uh, that that you trust somebody, you bring somebody into your confidence, uh, and, and and they will just fuck you. Uh, it, it, you know, just just unbelievable. I mean, you know, this is why I say, well, my mother's dead. But don't don't trust your your own fucking mother. Uh, you cannot. And maybe I'm using the word trust a little bit wrong. It, it certainly depend. Uh, you know, Lou Reed talking about this in New York stories that you can't depend on your mother. Uh, it takes a busload of faith to get by. You can't fucking depend on anybody 
you cannot trust anybody not to fuck you over. And uh, as much as I love all my new friends, you know, it's just this lesson that I learned uh, today once again. It's like how many fucking times, Hambone, are, are, are you going to learn this lesson? That, uh, you, you know, especially from this point forward, don't trust anybody. Do not depend on anybody uh, from here on out. You know, and then as I say, I don't trust myself as as far as I can throw myself. Uh, and I hate to say, I hate to sound like this. I would absolutely uh, love not to be having this uh, depressed collapsitarian wine. Look at that. You know, just this, this big fat black mark, this splat, just just destroying this entire weekend one year uh, that Sandy and I have been talking about this, all that I have been through, everything that I have been through to uh, come up here and, and have this party at Sandy's place and, and have all of these beautiful, loving, good vibes and then just, uh, and, and just one fucking little I guess it was actually three emails. Just, just this toxic cannon load of uh, uh, of just you know just toxic nasty shit coming out of someone who you honestly considered a friend that that you considered a friend and a confidant and uh, you, you know one of my lieutenants. It, it, it hurt like hell to to kick this dude uh, out of Humpty out of Humpty Dumpty Drive. But uh, you know, if I if I'll kick this dude out, hell, who would I not kick out? You know, so eventually I'm gonna kick uh, Hambone Little Tail's ass out of Humpty Dumpty Drive. That's the motherfucker I need to kick out once and and for all and forever. Just kick that fucking Hambone Little Tail's ass out of Humpty Dumpty Tribe. But we have lost a lost a tribes member. And brother, I, I appreciate everything you've done for Humpty Dumpty Tribe. But you stepped over the line. But anyway, he had bowed out anyway. I didn't have to kick him out. I guess he'd already left. So thanks for stopping by this channel, brother, and uh, I hope you find what the fuck you're looking for, because whatever you hope to find in uh, Humpty Dumpty Tribe, you just fucked up, buddy. It's gone. Go look somewhere else. Take your toxic shit somewhere else. But uh, I'm here at another locked gate in my life, so I'm going to wrap this up. One more time. Smoke them if you got them, but smoke them by yourself because you, if you ain't fucked yet, you will be fucked. Bye, guys.